Hi, my name is Professor Jeremiah P. Alioso, Coordinator for the Technology and Online Education Office, and I will be walking you through with a step-by-step -step process in using our learning management system. NEO is a world-class award-winning learning management system for schools and universities. The platform is known for delivering a great user experience while incorporating all the essential tools schools need to support effective teaching and learning. NEO is a product of Cyper Learning, a company that specializes in providing learning platforms for organizations around the world. We want users to get the best results when using our LMS, especially when you are just starting out. That is why we created this Getting Started Guides for the students. This guide covers the most common steps that you have to go through when they start using NEO, such as creating an account, enrolling in classes, viewing classes, viewing lessons and assignments, submitting assignments, communicating with users, and many more. The school portal is a place where you can find the class catalog with a preview of the available classes, a news area, and the school calendar and more. Using this platform, it requires a user ID and password. An email invitation to create an account will be sent by the LMS administrator. Follow the simple steps to get you started. Students would have to sign up and fill out the information such as the first and last name, login information, basic information, and contact details. After filling out the information, you have successfully created an account and you will be directed to the student dashboard. Let us further navigate the platform. To visit the platform, you have to go to this website. You will be asked to log in your user ID and password. The student dashboard is the first page you see when you log into your account. Here, you will find an overview of your classes and groups, and you will also see your calendar, to-do list, announcements, and many more. For first-time users, you will be invited to update your account or enroll in classes. But first, let us update your profile. Just like Facebook, your profile page contains your basic information, account details, friends, photos, awards, and more. The information that is visible depends on your account type and the platform's security settings. You can access your profile in the top right bar. Let's add profile picture on your account by clicking the edit button on the right bar, after which you will be asked to choose a photo or an avatar from your file. Click save and after successfully downloading the photo, you are done. The LMS also features communication channels. Oh, sorry. You can also add profile description on your account. On the example, you may have to add your course, your year level, and your hometown. The LMS also features communication channels to your peers and teacher. You may add your classmates as friends and start your educational collaborations with them. You may use the chat or message button to communicate with them. Calendar. The calendar features of the elements located on the right side of the panel helps you schedule your meetings, deadlines, and activities. Help Center. We don't want you to encounter difficulties 
when the first time you are using NEO LMS. Access our Help Center by clicking the question mark icon located on the top right of the bar. A pop-up box will open with options for choosing the searchable online help, getting started guides, and student help desk. The searchable online help has topics organized by account type and it includes detailed instruction with screenshots for most of them. And because the help center is a pop-up, you can browse through the topics without having to leave your current page. Also available on the help center is a downloadable and printable reference guide so that you can um, refer to this manual for your reference. Here are the features and buttons of our LMS that you can find on the Help Center. Also, you will be guided by the classes and lesson guides. Enrolling in classes. From the home page, enroll in a class by clicking the enroll button and enter the access code. Access code is a computer-generated code to be given by your instructors in the class. For further details, you may ask your program chairs and the deans as to the access code of your classes. Here's the example of a class. So we would like you to get familiar with how a typical cl class looks like in NEO, how to browse a class, explore the main features, and look at the lessons. This will also provide an overview of the lessons in the class. The left bar has tabs that give you the direct access to the most important areas in the class. On the right bar, it displays your progress through the lessons, mastery, games progress, and to-do list and announcements. So here are the assignments or activity button, okay? And there are 12 different kinds of assignments or activities that may be given for the asynchronous mode or offline learning. And these are quiz, essay, offline, survey, discussion, debate, team, Dropbox, SCORM, attendance, turn it in, and custom LTI assignments. For the synchronous or online mode, synchronous or online meetings will be conducted via Google Meet. Links and schedules can be found in your LMS. To get you updated with the latest happening and announcement, you may view the news page located on the home page. For questions, don't hesitate to contact the LMS administrators on this email addresses. Thank you, and we hope you have a wonderful journey learning with our NEO LMS in St. Anne College Lucena. St. Anne College Lucena, truly class beyond Kazan.